Yep. your horse back, friend. Oh, you really were just borrowing it. Appreciate it. Hello, mister. How do you do? Good boy. Okay, boy? Howdy. You pay up, but we keep up. It'll cost a sweet penny to get out of this, friend. Hey, howdy, sir. Hello, sir. Hello there. Hello there. be back. Thanks. Warner. Hello. Easy there. Hey, mister. Welcome back. Good to see you back. Some poor bastard get bushwhacked by a group of street rats. Swarmed on him like a pack of wolves. In this place. You change your mind? I do right. Trust your gut, folks. Step right up. How's it going? Hello there, mister. Hi there, mister. Hello there. 
Hey there, partner. How do you? Good to see someone who ain't afraid of hard work. Work won't do itself. Gonna get you killed before long. I just want to get a drink. I'm parched. Give a fellow a nickel. Hello. Hey, boy. <laughs> Mister. No Hello, Mister. Heart. Hungry here. <laughs> they get a few cents. Hello, ma'am. Hello, sir. Hey, brother. I'm too old to get a job, mister. Way too old. Can't we be friends? business. All right, stranger. You can't uh, drink here, bartender. Come on, sir. Try to remember what really happened at Sylvia's Saloon back in 76. Just a lot of bunk, Plato. It's just a lot of bunk. It's not bunk, Mr. Calloway, sir. It's history. Ancient history. Who's your friend Not there? Ha! <laughs> Put that in your fucking book, Plato. This is Jim Boy Calloway. The Jim Boy, Boy Calloway. Who? The gunslinger. Fastest left-handed draw that ever drew breath. He once killed 14 men in a fight at Lucy Hollow. What are you waiting for? How do you mean? Well, I reckon right now, you kill him yourself. I don't want to kill him. I want to deify him. He's a god. I'm trying to write his biography. How's that going? I think I prefer the duel. Either I'd kill him and be able to be Baltimore's finest ever gunslinger, or he'd kill me and I could be set free from ever having to speak to him again. Well, you're starting to understand something very important. What's that? The joys of gunslinging. It's win-win, freedom or glory. That's brilliant. I'm gonna write that down, if I may. Be my guest. <laughs> What's your name? I don't have a name. But you are a gunslinger. Not really. I mean, folks who need shooting, I try and shoot in the back. All that other stuff, it's, well, bunk. But you fought duels. Once upon a time, I may have. And you ain't interested in fame. <sighs> I don't think so. Strange. But you like fortune. I need money, sure. Okay, then forgive me, mister, if I seem a little desperate. I am a little desperate. This book, I've got to make a thing of it, and, well, there's a whole list of gunfighters. Legends, every last one. Emmett Granger. Flacco Hernandez. Billy Midnight. Black Bell. Never heard of them. Maybe you can go and speak to them. Ask them about Calloway. Any of them get uppity, shoot them. I can't believe I just said that, but... You want me to go and find some sad, deluded fools like him, ask if he was the greatest, and then if they get uppity, shoot them? It does sound a lot worse than it did in my head. How much you paying? Well, a lot. Half the proceeds of the book, if you help me get it written. I'll see what I can do. Ha! Oh, get photos. 
Okay. And there are notes on the back of those portraits that should lead you to him. I'll see what I can find out. I imagine we'll be stuck here upon your return. But here are some other flop house. here. Maybe this is our man. You a bounty hunter, mister? Maybe. It depends. But I'm guessing you ain't here to pass the day, turn yourself in, or discuss the finer points of county law. Then I don't need to know much more than that until I got a reason to. All right. You smell that? This here's a livestock town, mister. Tracks delinquents and reprobates like flies. Now, I'm not a fellow to pass a quick judgment, but I've been around long enough to know you don't hire a saint to catch a sinner. You bring me what I need, and I'll pay you well, and I won't ask no questions. So, what is it you need? Why don't you have a look at that poster on the wall over there? He's a low-down huckster. He's been poisoning folks with his miracle cure from here to Ansburg. Killed more than Landon Ricketts without even pulling a trigger. Gets some kind of sick satisfaction out of it. The feller over at the saloon says he thought he saw him by the gorge straight north of here. You think you can bring him in? The money's good. I need him alive, though. I want to make sure the women he witted get compensated before he swings. I'll see what I can do. Well, good luck to you. And we need him alive. That's an important point. Alive. I got it. Even the mystery.
just ain't enough of us. Well. And we need him alive. That's an important point. Alive, I got it. Evening. Nice evening. Evening, friend. Get out of the way, Jim. Uh, hey there, partner. Evening, partner. You'll be all right. Oh, well. Want to know the latest? Buy one of my papers. Yeah.
Easy, whoa. go.
Are you Benedict Albright? Oh, sir? Huh. Kinda look like him. And I was told he'd be up here. No, uh, not me, sir. It's because I want to buy some medicine. And I heard him. I heard good things. I'll pay in gold. If you could help me find him. It's just... My mother's real sick. Oh, well, if that's the case, if it's for a sick woman, I'd be happy to help. I'm a healer, you know? A medical man. Finest medicine in the state. <laughs> Game's over, mister. Put your hands up. I'm taking you in. Taking me in? What for? Apparently that stuff you're pushing is killing folk. And there's a price on your head. I don't know. It ain't my business. Come on, partner. That's crap. I'm a healer. I got an aura. I speak to spirits. That I'm a scientist. Folks get real angry for no good reason. This... This is a mistake. Keep your hands up, buddy. They only want you for questioning. I have to insist that this is a mistake. Don't be a fool. <laughs> Hold on. I'm slipping. Shit. Please. <laughs> oh, oh, you saved me. Now, come on, buddy. Let's make this easy. What? You're taking me in? It's just for questioning. Oh, hey, you saved my life! What? Ain't we had enough drama? I, I'd be better off jumping. I, they expressly told me not to kill you. What? Oh, this is about you. <sighs> Don't jump! Oh, 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 what? You can't shoot me! Oh. Please. I'll take my chance. Come here! Uh, bye, friend! <sighs> I really do not like you. Ah! Yeah. Shit. I got a cross. There just ain't enough of us. Well... And we need him alive. That's an important point. Alive. I got it.
Are you Benedict Albright? Oh, sir? Huh. Kind of look like him. And I was told he'd be up here. No, uh, not me, sir. It's because I want to buy some liquor. I'm slipping! Shit! Got across. cross. Swim to the edge. Grab on to something. Get over to the bank. Look out, the rapids. Hold your breath. you got, friend. I who made you judge? I'm only in it for the money. That's even worse. I'm sure it does seem that way. <clears throat> All right. Let's take you in. This is uh, very kind of you. And through. No business with you. Mister? Whole lot of ugly business here. Sir, I think 
I must be suffering from exposure. Oh. Oh. I seem to keep blacking out. Oh. Sir, I must warn you, my temperature is subnormal. I have medicine in my pocket. Would you pass it to me, please? This isn't necessary. I'm a medical man, a healer. It's all just a big mistake. Oh, I don't feel very well. I told you to <sighs> shut up. Well, who made you judge? <laughs> I'm only in it for the money. Oh, I don't feel well at all. You're a bully, sir. Here we go. Hey, don't you drag me into this. <laughs> you more in it oh my lord i wasn't expecting you back so soon uh, mrs caldorp was uh was just leaving sure where you want him i'm selling the back I thought I told you to shut up, partner. But I told but you. But nothing. Shut up. And, uh, good luck. It's been real fun. You ain't much of a man. You ask folks for forgiveness, you remember this, partner. I've already forgotten. Now, sir, um, how much was you offering? Uh, $50. Here. Thank you. Madam. Now, please, remember what I told you.
Hey there. Yeah. What is that thing they're smoking anyway? Beach meat? Sure don't look like tobacco. <laughs> Come on, mister. It's there on a the plate. He's missing all the cues. There's only so much canoodle. Let's get out of here. Well, let's see. I am gloriously fuddled now. I feel so light. Hair love birds. Heavy. At the same time. Have I told you what an amazing woman you are? <laughs> hey, all right, there we go. Oh, Arthur, Arthur, come here, come here, come over here. I want you to meet our friends. <laughs> Pleased to meet you. Well, ain't you just a toughest tick mountain man? Oh, you be quiet, Anastasia. Anyone can tell this one is a pussy cat. Exactly, yes, he's a pussy cat. Ain't that so, Arthur? Whatever you say. How much you cost, anyway? Well, ain't that a nice way to talk to a lady? Oh, I didn't know I was talking to a lady. Excuse me. Well, I must say, you got a fine way with the women, amigo. Yeah, regular dandy and a charm. <laughs> Where's Bill? Oh, man, I dread to think about it. Hey, hey, hey! hey there he is! Watch where you're going! Take it Are easy, Are you about pal. to kiss that guy Take or punch him? Fun, didn't I? <laughs> okay. 
Please, I beg you, stop. Come, sir. You won the fight already. Surely that's enough. What business <laughs> is it of yours? No business. <clears throat> no business, sir, but please, I beg you. Sir? Sir, are you all right? Making new friends again, I see, Arthur. Look who we found sniffing about. Josiah Trelawney. The very same. <laughs> well, I thought you'd gone to New York. And miss all this glamour. You must be joking. How are you? Well, quite well indeed. I went to Blackwater looking for you gentlemen. You're not very popular there, it seems. Ah, Javier and Charles. I've missed you. And Bill, looking as well as can be. Gentlemen, always a pleasure. You're right. We ain't too popular in Blackwater. We left a lot of money there. And young Sean, it seems. Sean, you found him? Yes, I have. He's being held by some bounty hunters, trying to see how much money the government will pay them. I know he's in Blackwater. But there's talk of them moving. Well, if we step foot in Blackwater... Uh, ah! Well, then we're dead men for sure. There'll be Pinkertons all over the place, but if he's alive, we gotta try. Yeah, of course. It's you they want, Dutch. Always is. Charles, go find out what you can, carefully. Josiah, take Javier. Arthur, go get yourself cleaned up. Join them when you're ready. What about me? Well, exactly. What about you? What does that mean? Oh, Bill, come on. Uh, uh.